Hi, this is Wayne Wallace, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to create an email link on your website. One of my um, members over on WA asked this question, how do you create an email link on your website? And I just thought I'd make a quick little video and show you how to do that. So here's an example of what you would put in your web page. It may say something like this, email me with any questions that you have. And then you want to use a, a uh, an anchor um, tag like we did in the other uh, linking video and but in this one what we're gonna do instead of putting an HTML um, URL in here what we're gonna do is we're gonna put mail to colon Wayne at WayneWallace.com that's my email and um, then when people click on the word email me it's going to launch whatever mail program they have and stick the email address that's here into the to line and then you can um, help them get started with an email right to you. Now I really don't recommend this um, because it's an easy way for spammers to get your email. They basically just scan all these web pages looking for the mail to um, word and then they know that there's an email right after that so they like to you know scrape web pages and find email addresses and spam those people so I really wouldn't recommend this I would recommend using a product like Aweber to generate uh, forms and then when people fill out those forms their email address goes into a database that you can then email a whole bunch of people later on and that's what's called email marketing and I've got a webinar this Friday coming up uh, on mymarketinghotline.com that's going to talk all about email marketing so go ahead and visit um, mymarketinghotline.com or look at the link below and you can sign up for that webinar and if you've come after the webinar then there's probably a replay on the YouTube channel for my marketing hotline as well so hope you enjoy this video and let me know if you have any other HTML questions. I'd be glad to make a short video and tell you how to take care of that problem that you're having. Thanks.